Hello. <laughs> um, it's me again, everybody. Just gonna show you guys um what to do when you go f um in between hero ROMs or whatever. Um, a lot of people are asking like uh, I'm getting stuck in boot loops or there's a bunch of stuff like going wrong or whatever. It's because you guys have to wipe your ext3 um, partition. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do that right now. <laughs> Okay, so first off, you're gonna want to go to no, don't look at me. You're gonna want to go to your um, cyanogen recovery. Okay, that's good. Um, and first off, you're just gonna want to do a normal wipe. Um, it's gonna ask you if you want to press home um, to continue. So yes, we want to continue. We're gonna wipe. Then you're going to scroll down to go to console, alt X. Okay, once we're inside of here, you press enter like the screen says. Um, and this is going to wipe our ext3. We're going to type in this command here. It's mount dash o space rw space backslash dev block backslash mmc blk 0p2 space backslash system backslash sd press enter press it did <laughs> we're gonna wait a while for it to, to clear the ext3 partition and there it goes. So after that, we're going to type in um, rm dash rf space system backslash sd backslash star. Press enter again. Bada boom, bada bing. Um, you're going to want to go to reboot recovery. Um, if, if something went wrong, like if you did, like forgot to, um, you went, you went to recovery and you forgot to put, um, a file, one of the hero ROMs on there and you're like, oh man, I forgot to, to transfer one of the hero ROMs onto my SD card. Well, no big deal because you can do it from here. So come back. You're going to type in enable underscore UMS. Um, once you click that, it's going to... Uh, it wouldn't say that. I'm already enabled. But anyways, it's going to let you transfer files from your computer, just as if you mounted it um, via you know, the USB cable and whatever. That way you can um, put a hero ROM on there or whatever. Once you're done, you just do disable underscore UMS. Uh, it's not, I don't think it's UMS, but anyways. Once you're done with that, you're going to go reboot recovery. Reboot recovery. It's going to reboot to recovery. You're going to give it a second. Couple seconds. Okay. So, once you're back into recovery, we wiped. We wiped our EXT3. Now we're going to wipe one more time. Press home to continue. Then, oh crap, that shouldn't be plugged in. Don't want to keep that plugged in. Don't keep it plugged in. Um, repair EXT file systems. And if you named your hero ROM update, like you renamed it update, you can um, apply SD card update zip. Or if you do what I do, and I'd like to just have a bunch of different ROMs to kind of go in between because I'm always trying out the new one. You can apply any zip, and you could uh, it could be something that you didn't change the name to. So right now I'm going to try out Madako because everyone's trying to tell me to try that out. So I'm going to give it a whirl. I'm going to click it, press home to continue. 
wait for it to finish installing. Once it's all done and everything, it's going to ask you to reboot. You're just going to click, click reboot, and it'll do the whole ROM thing, and you're all set. So, thanks for watching. That's what you're going to do every time you go in between Hero ROMs and whatnot. So, do it.